Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a contouring and highlighting um, video, but it's going to be a little bit different. I'm going to show you how I use my Maybelline Fit Me. What is this? It is the Shine Free Stick. You guys had asked for me to do a video using this, so here it is. I love using this product, especially when I want to have a more full glam on face. Today I'm not going anywhere, but I just really wanted to show you guys how nice of a contour this gives your, you know, your face and how easy it is to contour with this. And I'm also going to show you how to kick it up a notch to get your highlights game to be super strong. Now, I am going to be talking about the new and just released Luxie Beauty Kickers. I do explain in the video what kickers are, but pretty much they're just a base for your highlights. And I'm also going to be showing you guys how I use the Airspun Loose Face Powder to bake underneath my eyes. You guys know that I love this. This is my holy grail product since I got it. I I just I can't put it down. It's amazing and it just pretty much keeps my face matte looking really nice and even and it just looks amazing. So if you guys want to see how I bake, contour, and highlight using affordable products, just keep on watching. So I already started with my foundation, my primer, and pretty much the base of like my face to start contouring with. For my foundation, I did use today the NARS All Day Luminous Weightless Foundation in the color Syracuse. And then I did go in with my Black Radiance Complexion Perfection Shine Control Primer. Now when I really want to go for a super glammed out or it just depends really on my mood, I will go in with a stick foundation. This is by Maybelline. And it is the Fit Me Shine Free Foundation with Anti-Shine Core. And I got this a while ago in the color 355 Coconut. Now it is a tad bit too darker. I should have gone the shade next to it, uh, the lighter shade from this. But I didn't and I honestly haven't picked another one up just because I don't use it too much. Um, this does have a little bit of orange tint to it. So I do have to be very careful when I use this. But this is what I'm going to use to just um, contour my face today. So I'm just going to take this foundation to the hollows of my cheeks. Right there. It's really creamy and it's super blendable. So a little bit of this goes a long way. And then I'm going to take a little bit on the forehead. Right here. And then a little bit on the temples. Just a tad bit. So after I've applied the contour to the areas that I want, I'm going to go in with the e.l.f. Small Stipple Brush, and it's just a really small stippling brush. You can use a beauty blender, but I just really like how this blends it out. And I'm just going to start blending everything out. I like to start by the jawline, and I'm going to bring this down. Once I blended out my contour, I want to make sure that I set that so it doesn't move because I do have oily skin. So I'm going to go in with my NYC Smooth Skin Bronzing Face Powder and this is in the color Sunny. And I'm going to use the Sigma Large Angles Contoured F40 brush and I'm just going to apply this to the areas where I applied that foundation um, stick. Again, just so nothing moves.
And then the last thing that I do is I just go in with a blush, whatever you have works. Today I'm going to be using this one by Milani and this is in Rose de Oro. I love this one. It's one of my favorite ones from Milani. So I'm just going to take that same brush. No need to dirty another one and I'm just going to apply it on the cheekbone. So I went ahead and applied my concealer um, and then I'm just going to go in and start baking my face. This is the Airspun Loose Face Powder. You can find this at Walmart, Target, Rite Aid, CVS, Walgreens, pretty much everywhere. So what I like to do is I like to take the powder and apply it onto, um, what do you call it, the, the, the top. So I just like to apply my powder here. Now warning, if you do not like that talc, talc smell, whatever you, however you say it, you probably will like this because this smells like my abuelita, like seriously. This reminds me of what my grandma would smell like. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take my beauty blender. Yes, this is disgusting. Don't judge me. And I'm just going to literally just dip it in there. Just like that. And then I'm going to go underneath where I applied my concealer what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go ahead and finish off my eyes I'm going to apply some eyeliner and some mascara or maybe I'll skip eyeliner today I don't know but I'm gonna go ahead and finish off my eyes and then we'll come off and dust this and then we can just move on to the highlight okay so now we've applied my lashes and this has been here for about five minutes I'm just gonna go ahead and dust that off and that is all this is the elf complexion brush I love to dust the powder with this so now we're going to move on to probably my favorite part out of contouring and highlighting. So these are the new Kickers by Luxie Beauty. She did send a couple of these to me. Now this is not the final packaging. They have been released on her website and the packaging is actually better than this because they come in a little tube kind of like that MAC Pro Longwear Concealer where you just squirt it out and then you just put it on your hand or wherever. That's exactly what the packaging will look like now. I am not affiliated with them, but I do love their products. You guys know that I've talked about them a bunch of times here on my channel. The one that I'm going to be using today is called Divine. And again, the kicker is just a base for your highlights. Pretty much like a primer for your foundation. This is a base for your highlights. Now the amazing thing about this is that you can use it alone or you can use it underneath the highlight like I said just to give it an extra kick. I'm going to take a little bit on my finger and what I'm going to do is I'm going to start dabbing this right here right where you want to highlight. You can really apply this wherever you want. These blend so nicely onto the skin, like, you really don't need to work too hard with these. So now I am going to go in with a highlight just to top off this um, mousse, this cream mousse, this kicker that I applied. And for that I'm going to go in with TLS Highlight Powder in the color Goldie. I've been really into like these powder, like loose powder highlights because I feel like they don't emphasize my pores as much. So I'm just going to take a little bit of that and then dab off the excess product. I'm going to use this brush by the brand 6 Plus. I got this off of eBay and I'm just going to dab that on the top. So after you've applied everything, you're pretty much done. So this is the final look. I really love doing this just to get a more natural contour um, and just to brighten up my complexion really nicely without looking too oily. So if you guys did enjoy this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and also let me know what other videos you guys would like to see. That is everything for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and I will see you guys in my next video.